this is the time for myself for really, as much as anyone else. All right, we're off to the races. Hello, welcome to D&D History, um, and welcome back to Paris 1789. It is currently the evening of the 13th of July, and uh, can anyone remember what happened last time? Yeah. Um... So last time uh, we began the session uh, by leaping out of a window onto a corpse mattress that Tesla had prepared. Um, and uh, our, um, the, the lady that we had been uh, attempting to rescue, uh, what was her name again? Byron? Uh, I don't know remember her name, Florie. Yeah, yeah Florie Flore de Chiponte. Yeah, she, she was slightly injured in the fall, and um, the crowd decided that we were anti-revolutionaries <laughs> um, and proceeded to start chasing us. So Darudi picked her up and just booked it, um, trying his best to keep the crowd from descending on, on all of us um with as much less than lethal means as possible uh this <laughs> not lethal grenades <laughs> yeah not lethal <laughs> i got frustrated eventually my first grenade was a smoke grenade, <laughs> oh, was a friendly grenade. <laughs> so um you know we we, we uh, were running from the crowd we had um, some close calls i uh, i span around yeah. in some horse shit uh, I, mm -hmm. I presumed it was horse shit i, I, I didn't check i didn't have time um, Res I, didn't, I didn't get any beaten. close calls. I, I don't know. I don't oh. know what you guys were talking about. I was <laughs> in great shape. Yeah, Tesla looked like he was in in trouble for a while, but uh, eventually we did escape the angry mob, um, and we went back and took refuge uh, at uh, Fl Madame Fleury's husband's house, um, where uh, I think Darudi built a new bomb out of the gunpowder harvested from one of the one of the guns and some other stuff in the, that we found in the house. Um, Tesla had his zombies hanging out like in the back room with just like a coat over them. <laughs> uh, and then uh, eventually we went and uh, did, uh, you know, CSI French Revolutionary Paris uh, for quite a while. Eventually Tesla remembered that he had a ciphered note on him, which had exactly where we needed to go in it. So we found that and headed to uh, a, uh, you know, derelict apartment uh, within which, at the top, um, were several people that we met during the first session, but it turned out that they were actually time travelers. Um, and uh, they, they do not seem to be happy with us. Uh, so we've got four time travelers uh, who were posing as uh, Parisians. And um, I, I have a feeling that uh, we are, uh, you know, the, the, Stuff's about to hit the fan. <laughs> Quick question: Did did we all fail our perception checks? Because if I saw a fella in a gas mask, I would have questions. They, they, yeah, they, it was illusory. Much. Yeah, <laughs> they, they 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 had a um, they had they, yeah, they have like a glamour over them, so they looked like they weren't themselves. Um, but it became obvious when um, I think it was Tesla or was it Rasputin just got uh, really annoyed and. Uh, threw a punch at one of them and his fist just poof, straight through because the guy actually wasn't there. Um, so kind of a displacer beast. Uh, and hey, we have Tesla. <laughs> oh, thank God, just in time. Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. Um, no, no. Um, actually, yes, uh, that is excellent. That is much hits every single beat. Feel free to take your D6 inspiration dice. Um, my need for the coming fight. Uh, to clarify two things. One, it is um, presumably time travels. You don't actually notice. You stay look funky, so maybe they are. Uh, secondly, uh, yeah, one of them uh, shapeshifted in front of your eyes pretty much. Um, sort of uh, shrouds of smoke just wrapped around himself and as he started levitating up into the air. Uh, whereas uh, the chap who was up on a race platform, which had a word, I've forgotten what it was, um, he had his back towards you all. And it's only when he turned around that he saw that he's got some weird gas mask contraption uh, on his face. I think uh, the word you're looking for is loft. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, so yeah, the guy standing up on the loft. Um, uh, yeah, you basically just couldn't see his face when you walked in, so that would probably why. Um, and yeah, one of the girls kicked up a um, sword that was uh, 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 like tucked in amongst the cushions. 
just like sort of swing it up um, almost as uh, big as she is. It's a um, thin uh, great sword looking thing. And if Tesla is awake and with us, uh, we should probably all roll initiative. All right. Damn. Uh, I have a quick question. Can initiative, or sorry, initiative, can your inspiration be used for initiative, for attacks, for pretty much anything? Or is it just skill checks? Initiative is a skill check. Uh, thank you. Youch. That's a nice time to use it, actually, then. Wow. Natural one. Oh. Uh, 12. Oh my god, I also got a natural one. Wow. wow! I got an, I got two ones. That makes an eleven. I'm good at maths. <laughs> well, well, you know the, the the dice gods have been kind to us up until now, so we yeah. we, we all knew this was coming. Yeah. Up until I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and use my inspiration from last session, and add that because that's bad. Yeah. Oh fuck! That's still not that helpful. My initiative is a six. How, how have oh. I not earned a, an inspiration? I have an inspiration. It's by myself sometimes, I tell you. Um, Darudi's in, is right, his is right now seven, so I'm gonna try and see if I can boost this with my inspiration. Good god, it's not great. Ah, six, nice. nice. <laughs> so that's 13. Pretty, yeah, uh, have you stopped so, rolling in the dice log? Uh, all right, all right. <laughs> I don't think you can just roll directly into the dice log with a normal die, can you? No. Yeah, if you uh, go... Uh, there is actually in the bottom left, yes, a, a, a dodecahedron, which you mm -hmm. can click on and then just click a normal dice, yes. Oh, I did not realize that. I will try and do that. I, I have all of these all of these actual D&D &D dice just, here. Just that I really for the benefits of the audience <laughs> that don't trust you quite as much as I do. <laughs> I just admitted to getting a natural one. <laughs> You're playing the long game, eh? Hey? Just like yeah. all confidence tricks does. Marvelous. So that is um, all I had was a lot of ones. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Uh, initiatives are 11, uh, 13 for Rasputin, unless you added something to it. No, mine was six total, is my initiative. Six, all right. Six. 11, uh, Rudy just put his up to a 18, is that? 13. 13, okay. Oh, is that as including the six? God, God help you all. And, um, <laughs> Tesla, I a natural one. <laughs> Tesla was a 13 as well, right? Uh, 12, 12 total. Yeah. Okay, excellent, that's nice and neat. Um, and so, our uh, Sainas. To be fair, Ooh. they do have the jump on us. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, they do. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Um, oh, I hate these dice are so cool, but I can't make out what numbers are. <laughs> Seeing they clearly have the jump on us, uh, Byron stands for them, so stand behind me, guys. I've got this. I've got this. <laughs> I just remembered I had a long rest. Bottle of wine in one hand. <laughs> -ya! Beautiful. Oh, that's at least one twenty. Six. Mm. Oh. <laughs> Stop oh, laughing. Dear. <laughs> oh, okay, well, that's only a 10, though. So that's. Okay, so. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, boom, 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 boom. And so that means uh, top of the round is going to be um, Lady Celeste, who's this uh, woman with um, bun in her hairs. Uh, followed up with uh, Christoph, far to right. Then we have Rita, uh, which is the girl with the sword. Uh, followed by a Truti, uh, uh, then Tesla, then Byron, then Oscar uh, with the uh, gas masks. And then bring up the rear is Rasputin. Um, I'm just going to move this around so I don't just confuse myself whilst we're playing. Do, 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 do. Uh, what did you say the gas mask guy's name was? Oscar. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, do, do, do. So it's um, arranging all this. Uh, at least we didn't break up an exciting moment, why I think. 
Boom, boom, boom. Oh, it. it does look like we're about to fight Christina Hendricks. <laughs> she can I do whatever she wants to me. I yeah. don't know who that is, but good. The the woman, the redhead on Mad Men. Oh, cool. Uh, she's the one starting, so. Also, I think somebody mentioned in the chat that uh, she's also in Firefly. I forgot yes, all about that. Oh, yeah. oh, she's so oh, good yeah. at that. She's the one who's um, is it, uh, River? Uh, no, she doesn't play River. It's um, Saffron. Yes, the, the, she, she plays like a... Confidence um, trickster. Yeah, ba basically a, a kind of you think at the beginning she's an Amish girl that's been promised to to Mal to marry him. Ah, yes. Uh, and then it turns out, no, she's... <laughs> but we digress <laughs> to combat, gentlemen. <laughs> this has right. become a Firefly podcast. I'm sure there are none of those. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Um, right, starting with, uh, just call it Christina Hendricks. Yep. Um, she is going to... Um, as, as um, Rita down here uh, picks up her sword, uh, she takes the moment as the flash of steel distracts everyone, and she um, strides over to Tesla, um, smears some lipstick, uh, lipstick, lipstick, that's Swedish, uh, lipstick uh, uh, from her lips, and then uh, places it on uh, Tesla's lips. Could you roll a... Oh, she should have to roll an Wisdom. attack for that. Nope. Um, can uh, Tesla roll a um, wisdom that's, save for, uh, for That's the a things? nine. That's a oh. nine. I'd like... That is well, I'd good like news for you. A contested handsome check with Tesla. Why isn't she kissing me? <laughs> you are further away. Um, <sighs> Tesla, you are currently charmed by this young lady and her forward uh, swaying movements all uh, good things yeah uh you will be obeying her uh, verbal or telepathic commands I'm not sure exactly how telepathy works in this universe but definitely verbal uh, commands um can we kick yeah. tesla out of the group <laughs> uh, can i join tesla i will obey all your commands and return for a kiss <laughs> <laughs> um and she will ask you to um uh kill your friends Right. Joke's on you, the well, nerd's well, got no friends. That's very good point. <laughs> a very good point. She will just uh, point out uh, the environment and say, kill that one. <laughs> As you will. Right. And that is... Uh, she, she will take a ginger step away, because she's a little bit worried about your zombies not being charmed. But there we are. Um, <laughs> Meanwhile, um, Christoph, who is now hovering above um, Rasputin, uh, he is going to um, bring out a um, shimmering um, uh, dagger, long, almost a short sword, uh, and he will stab you with it. Don't forget disadvantage. Because of the spell? Because of the cloak. Yeah. That is uh, two freeze, which I don't think is going to hit. It's not. No. So it's specific. Okay, I suppose it's uh, whatever. It's not going to hit. Um, hard to get. Hard to get through that Rasputin stink. You want to get close, and then you just don't want to be any closer. You know. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> with no other real uh, things he can do. That's terrible. Um, he's just going to not have been the first person to stab me. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> he tries to stab you. You're like. <laughs> So that coming in my way. <laughs> um, and he's just going to hover above you menacingly. Uh, Rita, lady with the sword, um, and four, three, will come up behind you and then just darting forward uh, very quick uh, with her blade. And then she just uh, strikes at you saying, parry this, something, something <laughs> filthy, something casual. Uh, that is probably going to hit, though. Um, but I think that's a GD. Yeah, that's a dirty 20. Oh, yeah. And... Okay, well, uh, you're quite... Okay, you're quite lucky there. Uh, that's just the one hit. Uh, right. And uh, you feel the blade striking you in the back. Um, 
dealing uh, 10 points of slashing damage. I... Of course, the prostitute is the one to stab me. Um, and Tiruti, it is your turn. Okay. Um, I am going to. Uh, it's because I just saw Rasputin uh, get taken out uh, or, or get stabbed. Uh, I'm a little worried about hitting him. So instead, uh, I am going to unload fully automatic fire on Christina Hendricks here. Okay. Um, so yeah, I'm I, I'm I'm going for blood. <laughs> all right. That makes uh, sense. All right. So let's see what we've got. Um, and we're gonna roll to hit. Uh, that would be a dirty 20. Uh, 20 hits. All right. And uh, so that goes. Damage is 14. Um, and then also that's, there's an additional eight, eight in there. Um, I'm just going to roll again. Uh, cause I, I don't know where this, oh, I see the dodecahedron is bottom right. Okay. So I'm going to roll another D eight roll. Come on, come on, buddy. An additional six. So that she takes um, 14 plus six, uh, that's 20 damage. And okay. I'm gonna, yeah. How, how hurt does she look? Um, uh, yeah, I mean, the, the uh, bullets uh, just strike into her and there's uh, blood uh, pouring out of the dress. Um, uh, she coughs out blood uh, with a sort of vague panic look on her eyes. Okay, I'm shooting again, because yeah, this is, fully automatic fire. <laughs> so here we go. Let's see what's my second attack. Oh, wait. That's, yeah. Right, that's fine. That's fine. And then, uh, okay, so that, that's an 11 plus 8. That's 19. Does that hit? 19 hits, yes. Okay. Okay, that's uh, 12 damage plus the additional D8. And is that D, is that a D8 plus one or just a D8? All right, just next to the D8. This next to D eight. Okay, so damage. she takes uh, another. Um, there's another four on top of what I already rolled for damage. So sixteen okay. total. Yeah. Sixteen. Yeah. Excellent. Right. Um, so she took thirty six. I think. Mm -hmm. um, is she dead? <laughs> nope. Uh, Action surge. I'm going to shoot her again. <laughs> all right, fair enough. I want this woman gone. <laughs> uh, okay. uh, all right. All right, that's a 15. Does that hit? 15 will sadly miss, though. Ah, okay. Well, did what I, what I could. Somebody else take her out before uh, you know, she tells Tesla to do anything weird. Wait, how much damage did she take? A lot. Yeah, I think she None. took 36. Yeah. Oh, that's uh, a pretty she, high concentration check. That's... She's pretty perforated. Concentration check. Right. I, I don't know if the spell is concentration or what she does. No. Fuck. <laughs> There's no time for that. <laughs> uh, Tesla, um, it is your turn. 
All right. Uh, bonus action. Tessa will command Mark and Coleman. Uh, protect me from my enemies. And using his action, he's going to cast the spell Storm Sphere. Um, he's going to aim it towards the roof. Um, and it'll arc down the 20-foot radius, affecting Tesla and presumably Oscar. Um, I need them both to make strength saving throws. Uh, you mean Byron and Oscar, right? Yes, sorry. All good. Mm -hmm. Huh. Oh, well. That's an 11. That is a failure? That is a failure. Four, All right. four is a failure, right? Just, just, yeah. Check, just check. Yeah. All right, so you both take 11 points of bludgeoning damage, and the area in that 20 foot sphere is now difficult to rain. And since you're both within 30 feet of it, Actually, any creature within 30 feet of it has disadvantage on wisdom perception checks made to listen. But okay. I don't think that's too much of an issue at the moment. So, uh, where was it centered? On Byron? Uh, on the ceiling, so that it would arc down and hit him. So, yeah, sorry, centered on Byron. Yeah. So that might radius. end up getting Darudi as well. Yeah, you said 20 radius, yeah? 20 foot radius, yeah. Um, is it square five or? Yeah. That's quite a big spot. And you're probably going to end up covering that whole corner of the room. Yeah. All right. So, so should be about eight squares total. Yeah, it's basically this corner. Yeah. Um, so I think I've got Drudy in that as well. Sorry about that. Uh, that's all right. I, I've had worse. Is this it, it, this is electricity? Uh, the first point of damage is bludgeoning, but Blood. it is a storm sphere. Yeah. Um, I need you to make a strength seven throw as well, Darudi. Sorry about that. All right, that's Darudi. He excels at <laughs> this. Not as. Let's see. Was it eleven hit points damage? Oh, yeah. Yes. Uh, seventeen pass. Uh, seventeen will pass. Yes. Nice. So half damage. Nice. Then. Yeah. Uh, half damage on success. No, it's oh, no damage I, on a success. Nice. I rolled wrong. I just rolled straight strength instead of a strength saving throw. And your saving um, would have been even better. So. Yeah. <laughs> That's fine. We'll call it. Uh, your also your camera's blurry. You're going to give someone a migraine. Oh. <laughs> Let me. Let me back up a bit. <laughs> All right, and. Um... But little uh, zombies, they're going to move around to protect you from all potential angles. <laughs> How much damage did I take? None. Uh, none, yeah. If you if save on the first one, no you damage. take none. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Right. It's unfortunate. Yeah. Ian responds. Um... Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I meant to do that. Do, 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 do. I meant to do all of this. Stupid. Why are you using area effects, stupid things? Okay. <laughs> it sounds like a it sounds like a you problem, Toby. Yeah, Toby, until you control shift down it to the bottom, it's still going to be in the way. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. It's just uh it, move this guy down and I don't know it's just so bloody annoying it's stupid. <laughs> I'm no longer DMing for anyone with area effects just uh... what do you mean that, that guy was down there that guy definitely got hit by that <laughs> <laughs> oh no he, he well he's, he's just his movement to you know move. oh that's his movement now okay fair enough yeah. <laughs> yeah he does have half movement at the moment in yeah. that space How? Control Z is your friend. <laughs> so everything, so everything. Doesn't help him using like three different keyboards as well. Uh, if he ends his turn still in the space of the storm sphere, Toby, I need him to make another strength saving throw. All right. Um, but he doesn't, as he's uh -huh. used half his movement to get out of there. Shame. Um, and looking around, uh, he is going to target. Uh... Right, he, he moves his arms up. 
and starts uh, weaving uh, sigils in air. And then two uh, spiraling beams fly out, striking Dorothy, being one with a ranged weapon. Uh, I want you to take and make a uh, wisdom saving throw and mm -hmm. a constitution saving throw for me, please. All right. Okay, so let's do a uh, wisdom saving throw. That would be a 20, wait, wait, is that, I don't know where that landed. It either landed really well or really uh, bad. <laughs> I've got good news and bad news. Uh, bad news is that you just rolled a five. <sighs> okay. I'll, I'll tell you the good news later when I think of some. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And then I'm going to roll constitution. It was almost an 18 and like on my screen, it stopped between the 18 and the two. <laughs> oh. And I'm like, what, what, what is... <laughs> When you toss a coin and it comes up neither. Oh, okay. Well, you get that at least. 23. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, 23 and 5. 5 on the whiz, uh, okay. 23 on the con. So, yeah, um, as, the, as this weird aspiring beam strikes you, uh, you, you feel like a little sort of jolt as um, the room spins away from you and changes colour. And you look at your hands and I don't know if uh, uh, Dorothy would have been familiar with effects of LSD for example uh, but things turn very strange very quickly uh, <laughs> you are currently confused uh, okay so you can't take reactions until you uh, end your next time mm -hmm. uh, on your turn um, you can't move and you'll take your action to make a um, melee or range attack against a randomly determined uh, uh, creature within range. So oh, that'll be no. exciting. We'll be rolling for who you get to shoot at. <laughs> I've, wanted, I've wanted to shoot at you guys for quite a while. <laughs> uh, right, and that is that. Then that will be Byron next. I've wanted to shoot you ever since you hurt that beautiful woman. Um, I'm going to uh, try and charm Tesla and bag face okay uh, they need to both do wisdom saving throws please beautiful is this a um a spell yeah yes yeah cool, cool. that's a eight from me that's mm. a fail that's a 19 for um um uh, oscar okay that's a pass uh but tesla you are now back to normal Friends, friends, friends. Are, these new guys are not friends. Like, that is beautiful. Cool. Now, uh, uh, Byron, that's could, not you, my go um, could you roll a um, what's it, wisdom saving throw? Uh, yeah. Excellent. Well, what, what is uh, that, as, uh, as you try to charm him, uh, the man moves uh, moves his arm and um, gestures in the air, and um, he uh, reflects the spell back at you. <sighs> A fifteen save. I don't know. I mean, oh wait, 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 wait. I should probably check if that is yours or his DC. Yeah, I will say that it's using his DC, so that would be a pass. Okay. Phew. Excellent. Um, what a wily fucker. And so, <laughs> I'm <laughs> difficult terrain, you say. Mm. 5, 10, 15, 20. I can still do it. Um, yeah. Oh, sorry. I tried to move the counter. Uh, if you could run me towards the pretty lady. Yes. Up and to the left. Uh, just do control shift down. Uh, I'm just going to do this. Right. To the left. Um, to the left. Um, um, That's all the song I'm allowed to sing. You get to about here. Yeah, uh, I will use, um, yes, uh, a dueling pistol Okay. in, in her pretty, pretty face. <laughs> Lady killer. <laughs> Rude. Uh, oh, let's go for it. Uh, I'm, no, 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 let's not. Okay. Pistol for her. 
does a 23 hit. I'm afraid it does hit. I shot this lady with a 23 in her pretty face because she didn't kiss me. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm a lady? I'm the first <laughs> incel. <laughs> <laughs> You want to roll four damage? <laughs> Episode title, the first. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, that will be ten. Woohoo. Um, and yeah, I... uh, at close range, the bullet just tears through her. You can see it just like it's gone straight through. Um, uh, she stumbles backwards. Um, you just her beautiful visage ruined with bullet holes and blood. Is she dead? No, but she's pissed. Uh, okay. Um, well, you say it, she fell down, yeah? She's stumbling backwards. Yeah. Excellent. Well, uh, I would be a foolish monk not to take advantage of a lady as she's falling. <laughs> so, um, I, that was a joke on falling from grace rather than a... Uh, and it, it, uh, Rather than Byron taking advantage of one. I just failed, yeah, I, I just failed that role, let's say. So, be, 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 be careful, you're going to get Lord Byron cancelled. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I have literally, in my research for this episode, I uh, heard a podcast about what a fuck boy Lord Byron was. <laughs> but I shall persevere. Uh, I'm going to roll a key point to dash, uh, so I can be within melee range. Oop. I'm going to uh, hit her with a bit of the old, uh, uh, bit of the old sword stick. Uh, does a sixteen hit? I see sixteen. So you just, yes, yes, yes. Please yes. finish this one. I know the rules of this game. Uh, and eight but damage. I need Tesla back so bad right now. Sorry, how much damage? Eight. Eight, all oh, right. Just uh, what kind of punch? Um, I, I, I'm just going to punch her in the solar plexus and help her on her way down. All right, okay. Um, yeah, she just falls over, wheezing, uh, spraying you with blood in the process. Not dead, though. Still vaguely standing. Uh, okay, interesting. Um... I'm going to then go again. Another key point. Flurry of bro blows. Flurry of bros. Flurry of bros. <laughs> That's <laughs> such a good spell. <laughs> uh, and, and give her two bonus punches on her way down. <laughs> I teleport her to Miami and cast Flurry of bros. <laughs> Uh, I presume uh, w when she's down, is there any advantage? Oh, kicking a woman when she's down, is, is that a good strategy? Be, she's considered prone, wouldn't she? Yeah. Yeah, melee attacks get advantage, ranged attacks get disadvantage. If I, remember I mean, she's correctly. not. She's just doubling over. Oh. oh. Just for flavor's gotcha. sake. She's not actually on the floor yet. Understood. Okay. Um, uh, <laughs> then a 14, I presume, misses. Fourteen will sadly miss. Okay, well that's my go. With well, the thanks. flurry of blows, you get multiple attacks with that, don't you? Yeah, they both missed. Uh. Right, well, and also thank the fates for that. Um, as uh, you, she um, looks up at you with just terror in her eyes, um, and she. Uh, she, yeah, no, she will just whisper a couple of words into nothing, um, and she will phase out of existence. As a reaction? No, oh, as, as the top, top, top around on, his on her turn. That skips me. Oh yeah, you are Rasputin, you are the next after Byron. I knew that. I Thank pay you. attention. Thank I am in charge of this game, I know exactly what's going on. <laughs> <laughs> it is your go. That's all right. I literally make all my players uh, when I DM write down uh, uh, initiative because I do that shit constantly. Oh, yeah. Um, I, I have a list right in front of me. I just ignore it. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, just, I'm so, just focusing on her like dwindling HP without really paying attention to anything else. 
um, Rasputin, okay. Uh, Re- Rasputin, uh, having seen uh, her pull some sort of charm thing on Tesla, um, is really uh, upset that somebody else is attempting to charm anybody other than himself. Uh, oh, no, I, like, I, I raise a finger to Rasputin. P- p- please, let, I've, I've let, got this, I've got this. Oh, I want her to die so bad. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but she's pretty. I want to see her again. <laughs> oh, Christ, no. Um, <laughs> So, uh, first off, uh, I'll let loose on two Eldritch Blasts towards her. Uh, uh, and that's a 23 for the first one. Right. And a 20 for the second. Right. That's eight and eight each damage. Well, I regret ruling that she wouldn't get resistance from the uh, machine gun. Uh, It's (laughs) technically magical. Uh, But that will, yeah, just, um, you can see her mumbling to herself um, uh, some sort of incantation, perhaps. And Rasputin, being the occultist, I is going, nah, not today, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and after he lands those two, he'll turn around and give like just the the creepiest grin he can at the at the two people around him. Look okay. back at the woman and wink, and then as a bonus action, cast Misty Step. Okay, uh, she's dead, and Rasputin <sighs> misses steps. Where um, I would like to go um, towards. Oscar and that ladder uh, as close as I can get and then I'll use my 30 feet of movement to try and get up that ladder onto the loft with him. All right, so rushing past them to uh, shoot, shoot, uh, yeah, you probably go up to like mellow range. Okay. Um, well, climbing speed. Now, say so you will be, you can either stop uh, at the bottom ladder or halfway up ladder. Uh, I'll stop at the bottom of the ladder next to uh, I forget I forget Tesla the zombie. name of our of of whichever undead friend that, that is. <laughs> I don't think we gave them names. I think we did. Oh, we did. Oh, we did. <laughs> Sorry, oh, Tesla, I, Tesla remembers. I think yeah. you named them after your assistants, yeah. Mark and Coleman. Yes, <laughs> Mark Twain and Coleman is actual system. <laughs> Uh, I would have I would have left her for you, Byron. But hearing that she was going to phase out of existence, I uh, I don't know if I could have let her disappear. We can, we, can tra- we can travel back in time. Our, uh, <laughs> we'll, we'll go back six seconds, um, and that'll be the end of my turn. Bonus action, action, movement. Beautiful. Yeah. So the DM regrets um, explaining what uh, the woman's plans were about to be, um, and so we have these piss people. Rasputin has a complicated understanding of the timelines. Well, I guess, fuck, that's very meta. That's my bad. That's <laughs> big my bad. Uh, that's right. Uh, I also, yeah, I mean, I would rule that how did you even see this was happening considering you are surrounded and being beaten up by, but whatever. Who pays uh, attention to uh, the men when there's a pretty woman <laughs> kissing Tesla? <laughs> <laughs> this is very true. This is how she got to blow in. Uh, <laughs> Christoph thought that he was um, uh, distracting you with his emo ness, but actually you were distracted by the kissing. Now, uh, Byron, um, whilst all this is going on, Christoph signs up to you and goes, Hello. He doesn't say like that though, because he's, <laughs> he's like all emo y. Hello. Um, and he stabs you with dagger. Um, for, that's 25. I, I have never seen Christoph uh, hit a thing in this entire campaign. I <laughs> thought he was a pacifist. Uh, <laughs> uh, well, technically, I said he didn't really hit you. Uh, he stabbed you. Four. That's not too bad. Somebody's about to have you a plane take, crash into their house. Uh, marvelous. Uh, you take 18 points of necrotic damage. Um, and can I have you roll Constitution 7 for everyone, please? 18? Not nothing. Tis but a scratch, my friends. Fear not. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
uh, is a six a pass? No. <laughs> right, your permanent uh, HP has been reduced by um, 18 points. Oh, oh no. I mean, I mean, you know, there's easier ways of saying fuck you, Toby, if, if that's the case. <laughs> 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 there's, there's low, there's, there's already the low constitution. 35 <laughs> minus 18. Okay. <laughs> so. uh, fortunately, that's all you can do uh, for time being. But no longer blocked. Um, his friends slide this up to you, and uh, you feel a thin, very long blade um, uh, <laughs> being uh, jammed through body. That is a 23 and 18. Uh, yeah, that, those are both both hit. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Uh, no, because I did a certain type of attack. Uh, wait, if it is my armor class, it Are still hits. If it hits my armor, yeah. yes. if my armor class is 18, it hits an 18. Yeah, <sighs> Damn it. yeah it'll hit. They're both hit. Right, that is 17 points of um, uh, being stabbed with sword damage. I mean, I only had six hit points. Dude. Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, oh, wait, and also if your permanent hit point can reduce, but that is actually technically permadeath. Wait, how? Well, you're lucky that she wants to take you alive. Um, no, no, but... no, no. So I'm on six. I have 18 permanent hit points. I've just got okay. hit by 17, right? Yeah. yeah. T Toby, if you don't like my character, we could have talked about this out of game. <laughs> <laughs> like, like... They were going to kill Rasputin, and then Rasputin is blinked out of existence. I'm... <laughs> Yeah, yeah, fair enough. Blame him. I know, but... <laughs> you are literally the only one in range. I'm trying to bend the rules to permanent my character. Excuse me for taking it a little bit personally. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're not permanent, but, uh You, however, are stabbed, and then uh, the woman brings up the pommel of blade, and just knocks you square in the forehead, and I believe that you're unconscious. I, I am, yes. I'm on death saving throws. Uh, yes. But good news is that um, they won't keep you, uh, take your life. So if they kill your friends, then maybe they'll be able to revive you or one of you. We shall see. Uh, bum, ba, dum, ba, ba. Do, do they want me to make babies for the future? Is that, is that the plan? Superhuman breeding yeah. machine. Superhuman yes. DNA. Yes, Byron wins! Achievement unlocked! <laughs> Sorry, guys, I've got a more important mission right now. <laughs> Achievement unlocked, Jeffrey Epstein's dream. <laughs> uh, then he should have gone with girls after puberty. We're definitely going to have to edit that statement out. <laughs> uh... <laughs> so your plan oh, is no. to breed. <laughs> i got bad news for Jeffrey. Yeah. Boom. Right. You are knocked out, unfortunately. I am very sorry to say. However, your friends may avenge you. Dorothy, you are standing in the middle of a lightning circle. And he's confused yeah, and I, will attack randomly. Uh, aren't I like higher confused? Can I make a. Oh, yeah, you are confused. It? That's a very good point. Yes, uh, we have to randomly determine. Do you want to roll dice? And I will pick a number sure. for what, what, people there. What kind of dice am I going to. Uh, I'm on. about to find out because I can't count. Uh, so we'll find out how many people are. Uh, there, there's amount. seven. Roll d8. Okay, I'm rolling a d8. <laughs> Wait, I already rolled a, a d8. I got a one. I, who, who, yeah. I got a one. So who do I hit on a roll of one? Christoph. Uh, yeah, Christoph. Okay. Well, uh, okay. So I'm going to uh, use violent shot. Um, so I'm going to extend one of my grip points, and let's uh, let's see what we get. So. I don't know who I'm shooting at, but I'm gonna shoot hard. <laughs> yeah. Um, if he wasn't playing a Spaniard, I'd crack an American joke now. Hmm. Uh, that is fourteen. Fourteen will just hit. 
awesome. Uh, okay, so um, I'm going to roll my attack. And that is... 15 damage. Yeah, plus uh, another 8. So let's roll the d8 here. Oops, just one d8. What? Why? Why is it now telling me three? Every time you click, it'll add to the d8. Ah. <laughs> Roll. And um, violent shot allows me to add um, eight. <laughs> so fifteen plus eight. Twenty-three. And then, yeah, and then violent shot uh, allows me to add. I know this game. Uh, Bloody fighters just damage. An additional weapon damage die uh, per grit point spent. So I spent one uh, grit point. So that allows me to roll additional. Is that an additional d8 or is that an additional yeah. attack? Yeah, it'd be an additional d8, I think. That's an additional d8. Okay, um, so let's get one more in there. Christoph, I'm so disappointed in you. <laughs> uh, that's an additional two. Um, and then, so does my second attack also go against Kristoff? Or can I control that attack? I think it's only one attack, but um, oh, I was confused. Used to rules. Um, yeah, do, do you want to do use the this D8? action to make a, a melee, yeah, make a melee or range attack against the random determined? So, okay. do you get two attacks per action? I don't know. What do you guys think? It sounds like one. Or wait, it says one action or one attack. Yeah, it's just one a attack. Yeah, I would say just one, one attack. Okay, so yeah. twenty-five. What happens then? Total, yeah. All right. Um, Christoph is also riddled with holes. Do you get it? Yeah, and um, so do I have anything that I can do here? Like, do do I roll to see if I can break out of the? No, um, but uh, as you fire, you come to your senses and um, the spell uh, wears off. Oh, great. That's awesome. Um, yeah. Can I but you, can, you can't can I do uh, But that's at the end of the turn. So at the end of the turn. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, so I, I, now I get my second attack, right? Oh, that, that's like yeah, uh, that's attack. the end of the turn. Yeah. So you're confused, you fire, and that's the end of the turn. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. So, so no other. I can't move out of the Tesla storm or anything no. like that. I'm just stuck here. Yeah. Okay. Sorry. Do I have to roll another strength check then? Uh, Tesla. Uh, yeah. What? Yeah. So, what happens at the end of your turn now? At the end of your turn, another strength check. Yeah. Okay. So this is uh, and this is the end of my turn. I can't do anything else. So. And remember, so it's strength my... saving, not strength check, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes! <laughs> uh, 19. Should be a pass? Yes. Wait, there's the wrong. <laughs> That's like what happens? Uh, nothing if he saves. Oh, cool. Brilliant. Uh, that's all good. Um, and so, Tesla, it is your turn. All right. Uh, Tesla's going to use a... <clears throat> well, Byron's down. Uh, he's going to look to the lady. The lady's not there. Um, so the target he's been charmed by is not there. Um, oh, no, she's there. She's just in a crumpled mess on the floor. Okay. Would the charm have ended in that case? Oh, yeah, you, you were charmed by Lord Byron. Were, yeah, you yeah, were charmed so by you're not Byron, charmed. So. I thought that was reflected. No, 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 no. he did. It, he, he tried to charm you and the guy in the gas mask. Gotcha. He charmed you. The guy in the gas mask reflected it back at him. All right. I'm, I'm, I'm up to date. Um, I'm going to <clears throat> have... My bonus action, I'm going to target a lightning bolt towards this lady here. All right. So that's an attack roll from me. Yep. Will a 22 hit? 22 will just about hit. All right. That's 46 lightning damage. I re-roll. I, I treat ones as twos. Roll. So that's 18 points of lightning damage. Okay. My bonus action. Um. <laughs> And then for my action, I've got clear movement here. Cool. I'm going to move around um, <clears throat> to the north northwest so that I have the fella and the lady in a clear line. Um, 
ideally so Daruti is not in a straight line as well, lining up for a lightning bolt. So arcing around to the northwest. Okay, uh, so you want to head up northwest? Yeah. Five, okay, 10. Um, 15, 20, 25, about here ish, I think. Uh, down one. Dunk. And then I should be able to get one. No, yeah, there. That's okay. fine. Um, and that should. Actually, just right above them, the second square from above them. How long? The three across to the right. Okay, right and, there, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, there we you go. Want, you, you want to get like some sort of weird straight, straight line going. Yeah, exactly. And ideally, Rudy's not in it. Um, I think it just misses me. Yeah, perfect. All you right, I will, I will shoot that lightning bolt towards them. That's a DC 16 dexterity saving throw. Do you not just shoot the lightning bolt? I do, but they make a dexterity saving throw, regardless. Okay, no, I, th I thought you just shot the lightning bolt at uh, uh, the girl. Uh, but is that, uh, that was that was a that was a bonus action from Storm Sphere, which uses Ooh. concentration. Ah, yeah, yeah. So he's like sort of shoots out sort of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like a giant tesla oh, cool. That makes sense. That's it. Yeah, like big, that's cool big, as hell. Okay, sweet. Right, so uh, dexterity saving throws from these. So, uh, Ed Edison thought Tesla ooh. ran out of lightning, but he didn't. He never did. <laughs> and yeah, uh, so the woman darts out of the way just in time, mm -hmm. um, whereas uh, Christoph uh, will look up and go, uh, as he's <laughs> just blasted in the face by the lightning. Perfect. So that's 96 since I'm casting at a fourth level. Mm -hmm. And let's roll away. Please explode this man oh with electricity. God. All right. That is, I've rolled one, one. So that's going to be one higher than it is on this. So that's 34 points of lightning damage instead of 33. Oh, beautiful. Um, his um, outfit uh, absorbs uh, some of the force, you notice. Yeah. Like it, it seems to like ground him, uh, he's like being grounded with it. Would this be a good time uh, to mention that my feet, uh, elemental adept lightning means I ignore resistance to lightning damage? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So oh my God. His, his outfit uh, absorbs, um, <laughs> it like tries to ground him and then it doesn't work. Just I charge it and he's like, <laughs> damn. But, like that sly grin on his face, like, yeah, yeah, I'm lightning proof, bitch. And then, <laughs> yeah. Not Tesla yeah. proof. <laughs> <laughs> so how much ridiculous damage was that? That was 34 points of lightning damage. Um, right. Unless the lady has evasion or some similar feat, uh, she would take half of that, which would be 17. 17. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, happy, happy days. It's times like this when I wish I hadn't tried to make a historically accurate character. <laughs> <laughs> And then I think my um, my assistants, Mark and Coleman, are still under direction to defend me from my enemies. So yep. let's see what they do. That's at your discretion. Okay. Um, I don't think Castle's got anything witty at the moment. Just um, there's a bit of panic and determination in his eyes as he's just trying to ensure his allies survive this and stay beautiful. alive. They will um, zombie forward. I've got to say, I love the images you use for the tokens. Absolutely delightful. Yeah. <laughs> So uh, the two zombies are going to zombie forward and they will try to zombie their opponents. Um, but I'll tell you what, just because it's funny and because they have a chance, I'm going to have them both gang up on uh, Christoph. <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh no, because that leads you flag, unfortunately. Ah, I think I might. I don't think it's going to get. That is an 11. And... Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. They unfortunately miss. Um, yeah. They're like good meat shields. It's a bad yeah. <laughs> Exactly. I mean, they're, they're sort of stopping in a kind of rush. And I'll tell you what, I, I would have had them swing up like this because, again, they're putting themselves between you yeah. and the enemy. Uh, they don't really care about Rasputin. Uh, speaking of which, <laughs> uh, Oscar. Oscar. <laughs> Swedish movie. Oscar. Uh, he's a little bit nervous about what's going on down below. Um, I would say because of the angle, he can't see uh, Rasputin from that angle. So, but however, he's he was aware that you're running towards him. She, she found. Yeah, he will move down to the little corner down here. 
Um, just nervously looking at this ball of energy. And it's just like radiating lightning down in front of him. Uh, and he shall shoot dirty again. Yeah. Uh, da, 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 da. Dirty. Can I have a wisdom and a constitution saving for me? For me sure. Let's, I think I know what's happening here. Uh, all right. So wisdom save. Come on, dice gods. Uh, that would be an 11. And then con save. That would be a 24. Okay, beautiful. Right, so, um, yeah, uh, again, uh, this weird hypnotic beam strikes you. Uh, but this time, just images of infernal darkness and everything horrific and scary. Um, uh, just uh, uh, what's what uh, appears in front of you. Uh, the world turns into a horrific place where um, the Republicans lose the civil war, and a, a wave of fascism uh, rises across uh, uh, Europe, sweeping all um, liberalism and democracy away. And even worse, um, Stalin happens, and you are now frightened for a minute. All right. With frightened, that uh, does that mean I don't take an action, or I just can't move closer to him or attack him? You just have to move away, right? Yeah, I believe uh, that. you just can't. You can't move any closer to him, and you have disadvantage on attacks against him, or you yeah. have disadvantage on attacks. I think w while he's within sight, but I would just if open a new tab and Google it real quick. If you're looking on your character sheet on D and D Beyond, click on the tab Conditions. It should be on the primary page, uh, and that will open up a bunch of them, and there'll be a drop-down tab that shows you the exact. Uh, but to, su to, su yeah, but to summarize, uh, you have disadvantage on ability checks and attack rolls, uh, whilst uh, this guy still, whilst you can still see this guy. Um, mm -hmm. uh, so you know, it's unfortunate that he's up on the platform. Uh, and yes, and you can't willingly move closer to him. Okay. He's freaking me out, man. <laughs> yep. Basically. Uh, you see socialism betrayed. Um, <laughs> I, 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 yeah, I see socialism betrayed. I see a bunch of people arguing about it online yeah, and <laughs> attacking each other. <laughs> you get an image of something called the Book of Faces, where uh, supposed leftists are just arguing with each other incessantly about everything, whilst the far right is just gaining more and more power. It's a true, it's truly a hellscape. Um, it's truly a hellscape. <laughs> Something like something called tankies are calling others anarchists, and you hate it. Uh, uh, yeah, ta uh, yeah, tankies are calling liberals anarchists. <laughs> uh, Byron, you are rolling if you are surviving or not. Uh, yes, I am uh, in a dream. Um, let me roll. Wish me luck, friends. Shall I step away to the light? Ah, perhaps I shall. 19. Byron realizes that there are still women out there who haven't felt this touch. You must step away from the light. Uh, I believe that's my guy. Rasputin. All right, uh, seeing what's going on, um, Rasputin will think about climbing up a ladder and think of about going back down and he'll just say, God damn it. And he'll uh, send a bonus action healing word towards Byron, uh, bring you back up. That's nine uh, points. That's like half of what you're you have available right now. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Um, and then oh. um, climb, climb up the ladder and make his way towards uh, Oscar and uh, was that really a bonus action? Son of a bitch. All right, so I was saying I'm it's, cursing um... with children in the background. Uh, sorry. Um, and then, uh, shit, I didn't realize that the healing word was also a bonus action. Um, 
as far as I can get towards uh, Oscar, I will. Okay, so it's five feet. To, well, taking it six feet, but what can you do? Uh, climbing up sure. the ladder. So, fam, dear fam, don't you wish you can touch? I mean, you can like skirt, skirting around the side of this. Sure. Um, um, yeah, you can get pretty, pretty close. And then I guess I'll uh, look at him and sort of just drop Ooh. my hands a little bit and say like, "It's just you and me, buddy," and let let loose a couple eldritch blasts. Okay. That's um, fortunate. Yeah. Uh, first one's a 21. Second one's a 26. Okay. Uh, he raises his hands to try to deflect them, and he's just too slow. Okay. Say, so fell into him. Uh, first one does 15. Second one does 9. 24 total? 24 total. <laughs> All right, he just like you blasted into the um, supply store behind him. It's paint everywhere. Yeah. Um, I should uh, at the moment, because um, on YouTube, give a shout out to the creator of this beautiful map. Uh, yeah. Who's this in is the corner here. Uh, I just really, really like the fact that um, she's uh, all the little artwork is just other maps that she's made. That's cool as hell. Yeah, I know. Anyway, so. Uh, so top of the round, can... unless there's anything else, is going to be Christoph. Love you. Yeah. Uh, who's being mobbed by bloody zombies. What is this? Fantasy? In my historical game? Boom! <laughs> and he stabs <laughs> oh, Byron's back up again, but he doesn't, he feels bad by killing Byron. But then again, does he? Does he know Byron's up? Byron's got the health, but he hasn't moved or anything yet. This is very true. Uh, I suppose he's just going to go straight to the source, really. Uh, he flies up, um, eliciting um, uh, reaction opportunity yeah, attacks attacks from opportunity from from the so, yeah, yeah, thank you. Tax opportunity. Opportunity attacks from all of us, right? Yeah, pretty much. Good day. Flies up in the air. Um, does a 17 hit? 17 what hits? <laughs> I'm imagining like a barely conscious Byron just like a still face on the floor, just like <laughs> swinging a little sword just, stick. I, I, I he, he, picked, up. he picks up his pistol and just... <laughs> well, 10 damage. <laughs> oh my god, and, and one of the zombies hit him as well. <laughs> yeah. Uh, hang on, let me roll Darudi's attack on him, because that's going to be fun. Well, um, unfortunately, it's, it's just um, the, the zombies and the Byron. But, uh, oh, okay. So I don't, I don't get that. Ah, uh, all right. Range. Yeah. Uh, what was the damage? Uh, Byron? Ten, ten damage from Byron. All right. Um, do we want uh, Byron or the zombie to kill him? Byron. Uh, yeah. So. This? Uh, the zombie bites him and slows down his flying, and as as, it, as he falls down, I just wake up, stand up, and just pierce a sword through the partially flying, half-bitten man, <laughs> right, right between his legs. <laughs> hmm. um, yeah, because uh, together, I hate you all, uh, he had eight, <laughs> 8 HP, and together you guys made, did 9 damage. Anyway, uh, yeah, so you just stab him. Impale them. Find me through your. Yeah, right up, up through the the perennial <laughs> area. Stop the taint. You stabbed him in the taint. <laughs> yeah. Perennial yeah. stink. Oh, he spits out. Blackguards, cat spawn of the ministry. You will never win. And he dies dramatically. Um. With that, uh, you hear a no uh, from Rita uh, as in retaliation, as is her turn next, uh, she tries to take your head off. Okay, so nine and 16. Byron. Yeah, he's trying to fix his audio, I think. All right. How, uh, I, yeah. how crackly am I right now? Sounds Not. fine. Sorry, was that good or bad? Good. It's good. fine. Uh, so what was the question? 
Using and it's an attack with a 9 and a 16. Does a 16 hit? Uh, no, actually. I think <sighs> because I used my... Now, let me check whether uh, as a... As a reaction using it, does that cover me? So this is very monkey. Uh, monkey. I know. Monkey. So, uh, oh, I can find it actually. It's plus two. Yes, there you go. Uh, I know. Okay, 16 does hit, yes. Ooh, right. Um, uh, that is going to be. Yeah, uh, ten points of yes, smashing damage. Yes. Uh, I'm back unconscious again. God damn it! Um, possibly um, exerting all your forces, uh, killing um, uh, Christoph, uh, made you so weak that you stumble forward, and um, the blow that was about to just take your clean a head clean off uh, glances, but strikes him back of the head and knocks you back unconscious. Uh, do, 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 do. She's going to use her movement. Oh god, the zombies in the way. God. Oh, yeah, can she get away? Yeah, it's big deal. We love you. Yeah. Uh, she will scream at you all. I see you all in hell. And she runs off towards the door. Uh, spitting blood and sp curses. Uh, you hear a what the fuck uh, from uh, her still surviving but very, very blooded uh, team member. Uh, Dorothy, you are up next. Um, all right, so I'm frightened. Uh, what I'm wondering is can I use my movement to run? underneath the ladder here so i get out of range of this guy because I, I don't want to see him because um, you are moving to like they're moving towards him then no well no no i'm not moving he's he's down in the bottom right corner so i'm moving in the, I, i'm moving away from him right. so yeah, i mean so it's it so. yeah so I, it look it yeah. feels to me like that would be moving away what do you what, what, what do you guys think? If, if I'm if I'm running to the far corner here to be, I can just get him out of my line of sight, <laughs> like up uh, towards oh. where the ladder is. Yeah, like uh, under he's in a loft. So if I run I mean, under the loft, if you can't see, see him, him. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But it's you, you've been moving towards him until you get underneath the loft. Though. Yeah, that's true. Be... I would be moving towards the ladder, not him. He's yeah, you'd no, have to move just, in a diagonal just straight towards north, the ladder. Northeast, yeah. perpendicular to him towards the other ladder, and you're safe. Okay. Yeah, that, well, that, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. so. Um, uh, how far can I go? Yeah, 15. It's difficult train, so it's half movement. Um, you get to about here. Okay. So I'll run to there. Um, and now, I, I so I, I can still see him. Um <sighs> You know what? I don't like the idea of this woman getting away. Um, so I am going to use my, uh, I'm going to attack her and I'm going to use a grit point uh, to do winging shot. So I I'm basically going to try to shoot her legs out from under her. Um, let's see if it hits. Uh, all right. So first attack. Um, how hurt does she look, by the way? Very. Very hurt. Okay, I'm using my, my pistol then. Um, so first attack. That is a dirty 21. Is that with uh, disadvantage? Yep, so then I'm going to roll it. Oh, I'm sorry, that was a 22. And so I'm going to roll again. Just with disadvantage, yeah? Yeah. So we take the lower... Yeah. All right. So I, I hit her with the winging shot. Um, so that is going to shoot her for. Yeah, you're right. Oh. Eight points of damage. Um, and uh, then she has to, uh, for winging shot. 
she has to make a strength saving throw, D DC 14, or be knocked yeah. prone. So yeah. basically, I mean, just, yeah, be knocked yeah. over on onto her, yeah, off her feet. Yeah, you're right. Balls. All right, well, that's a four. Uh, and she just clutters to the floor as a bullet takes out her leg. Okay. Great. Uh, and then I'm going to turn towards the object of my fear. Um, with, you know, uh, uh, what, what was his name? Not Kristoff, but the other guy, the gas mask guy. Oscar. 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 I, I am going to turn towards Oscar, and there's going to be this flash in my mind of everyone being terrified of something called a national Bolshevik. <laughs> um and uh i am just going to unload on him uh with my uh with my star okay i'm going to say that's not a thing <laughs> all right uh so also a disadvantage still yeah yeah still a disadvantage because i'm still frightened um so my first shot Let's see what I get. Wow, that's. I think that's actually a misfire. <laughs> I think that's Darudi's first misfire. So is his gun Damn. jams. Um, however, I can actually roll. Um, I have the ability to re-roll that once uh, per uh, whatever. So I, I'm going to roll and see if. As long as I don't jam it a second time, it won't jam. So let's try that again. Are you still rolling? Are you still Almost rolling? a misfire, You're but still not a misfire. Disadvantage, right? So you have to roll that twice. Okay. I mean, uh, the the attacks all rolls are at disadvantage. Yeah. Okay. It's, you're you're uh, shaking your hands like. <laughs> Which yeah, would a soul pipe might not be. There, there, there's this frightening evil Russian wizard named uh, Alexander Dugan that's just flashing through my mind and reminding me of uh, Rasputin. <laughs> um, all right, uh, literally zero evidence that they are not the same person. <laughs> um, yeah, so my gun does not jam, but I, I do, I definitely miss. Um, all right. Because unless, oh. well, well, hang on. Is his um, is is his uh, armor class uh, ten or lower? Nope. Yeah, so I totally miss. All right, much to his relief, because he doesn't want to die. Um, although yeah. Tesla, you're up next. Oh, and also roll a strength saving throw. Oh me? Yes. Yes. Uh, and is that a disadvantage? Yeah. No. No. Uh, no, no, it's, it's just ab ab ability scores and yeah, rolls. ability checks, attack rolls, no yeah. saving throws. Uh, eleven. And gets that. Yeah. Tesla. Yeah. Uh, yep, rolling damage. That yes, is I going die. to be. Sorry about this, Dirty. It's all right. Yeah. Soon we'll get you out of there, buddy. That's 10 points of bludgeoning damage. Okay, I'm going to use Stone's Endurance to avoid that, uh, to, to uh, absorb as much of that as I can. So I'm rolling a d12. Roll. So close. I, I absorb four of it. So right. I, I take six. What are, you, what are you being bludgeoned by? Is it just like the sound of thunder? I, I imagine it's um, debris and um, it's like actual street furniture and uh, earth that's getting racked mm. and torn and destroyed by the, um, yeah. the, the uh, lightning. Oh, it's 1d12 plus 2. So actually I only took a 4 damage. So Even better. Good stuff. Um, and Tesla, you are mm -hmm. currently next on the Okay. Yes. So, bonus action. I'm going to shoot a bolt of lightning from the storm sphere towards our femme fatale. <laughs> that's going to be. Oh, that's the wrong. Sorry. 
ignore that roll. That is the wrong one. Here She's we go. Four fine, yeah. Uh, it does count as ranged spell attack, but yeah. so oh, I've got to make the attack roll first. Hmm. Doi, pardon me. So eight's the lowest roll with sixteen, or so fourteen to hit. There we go. Fourteen sadly will miss. That's right. That's what I get for not thinking through what I'm doing. Um, very well. Then with my main action, I'm going to. Gosh, this could be really bad. But you got to do what you got to do, right? Okay. Um, I'm going to. Oh, I think that's just too stupid to do. I'm. I'm instead going to use my third level spell slot to cast lightning bolt at her. So she needs to make a dexterity saving throw. Uh, yeah, we can do that. that is, oh, wow, it's 15. 15, so she fails. So she's oh, going to no. take 8d6 lightning damage. Don't do that. All right, I rolled <laughs> a single one. So it's one higher than listed. It's 35 points of lightning damage. All right. With her nine hit points, she might be dead. <laughs> Uh, and yeah, as you just unleash lightning on her, um, this I won't say there's this is a very serious uh, campaign, but in this instance, it's just the shoes left, everything else is just a pile of ash. <laughs> uh, false, don't bump, but um, all right, all right, anything else, you monster. <laughs> um, I believe with his movement, he's going to move towards Byron um, and see if he can apply any sort of tourniquet or first aid. Um, I understand I don't have the action economy for that, but that's just the intention behind what he's moving oh, cool. for. Um, so the zombies, they'll try to aid you. Um, oh, good on them. <laughs> it's a very macabre uh, display. <laughs> The dead helping the dying. I like it. Um, <laughs> Why not? So, yeah, Master Oscar edging his way, um, yeah, literally backed up against the wall, uh, is going to, like uh, Doctor Strange, I believe his name is, weave in the air and hit you with two rays. Rasputin, uh, roll uh, wisdom and uh, constitution. Okay. Uh, it, as I roll these things, I just ask, does, do either of these things count as a poison? Nope. They okay, are wisdom. weird spiraling rays uh, being shot out of his hands. Wisdom is 15. Khan is 12. Ooh -hoo. Um, so you get the hit and the world is, um, it's fine. It's just moving very, very slowly. And then you realize that actually you're moving very slowly because you are paralyzed. Oh. Um, right. Yeah, I won't say like some sort of weird effect where all of time is just slowed down so much that you think that you're still moving, but actually in real life it's just marginal. Uh, yeah. But even so, you are currently paralyzed for one minute. All right. May, uh, repeat the saving throw at the end of your turn. All right. Um, right then. Uh, do, do, do. And with yeah. that, then TFM to Shivishifem to Shivishifem towards the. Oh my God. What's he going to do? So, oh. He will try to, yeah, he will try to scramble up the side of his wall and throw himself. So he's. Um, and uh, like holding on to the windows, trying to just jam them open. Uh, Toby? Yes? As I can do this at any point, I'd like to end concentration on the storm sphere, so it vanishes now. Boom! It's me, but you didn't do this earlier, but I will. Well, action economy, it gave me my bonus actions, but now I'm just not impeding Darudi, and... Yeah, yeah being sense. cheeky. Yeah. Okay. Cheeky people. Um, Yes. All right, uh, Byron, it is your turn. <laughs> You're again rolling death saving throws. I will roll a heroic death saving throw. Uh, wait, sorry, do I get to reroll at the end of 
oh wait, Oscar goes before Byron? I'm sorry. Yeah, uh, Rasputin, you're at the uh, end. Uh, yeah, it's yeah my Oscar, bad. Oscar, then Byron. I wrote it down wrong. That's my bad. Yeah, that's right. Byron. Wish me luck. Oh, bravo. Oh, May the gods be ever in my favor. I see your lips moving, but nothing else. Wish me luck. Uh, yes, that'll be a 14. Hey! Tally ho. Awesome. Ryan, rescue them. Yeah, so paralyzed. Uh, so I'll end my turn and just try that con save again at the end. Mm -hmm. Oh, son of a bitch! <laughs> That's a six total. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, that hurts. That's no good. All right. Uh, with everyone like dead, dying, or um, attempting to scramble out of a window. Uh, before we swing back up to top of the round, which is going to be um, uh, Dorothy. No. No, actually, no, we'll, we'll do one more round. We'll see if you can um, kill and or apprehend this guy. Um, Dorothy, your turn. Okay. Daruti is still horrified. Uh, he is seeing visions that there are people oh, who stream... Yeah playing video oh, yeah. games and talking about politics and people actually listen to them. Hundreds of thousands of people listen to them. And Rudy <laughs> says, um, the, he, he says, that is not the world in our hearts. And uh, he is going to use um, uh, his intimidating shot. Uh, well, hang on. So the guy's trying to scramble out. Mm -hmm. um, if I winged him, could I knock him like off, off of this and like onto the floor? Okay, I'm using winging shot then, uh, oh, and I'm going to use that uh, with my pistol. So let's see. Uh, okay, so he fires his uh, his Colt 45 madly. First roll is a nat 20, but I've got disadvantage. So let's oh. do this again. You can't see what the other roll is. Uh, Looks like a 14. Yeah, so that, that second roll is a 14. So does a 14 hit? Toby, you're 14 muted, will hit, yes. Okay, great. So I'm going to wing him uh, with the uh, Colt. And he takes from the Colt. He takes uh, nine plus four, 13 damage from the Colt. And um, he should fall, uh, hopefully, this, onto um, the actual floor. Yeah. Um, it's going to be a moot question, but is this um, uh, lethal or non lethal damage? Um, I, I was uh, I would say it's non-lethal damage because I'm I'm trying to knock him down. Oh, um, right. I, it's I, a moot point. It's just for um, yeah. uh, uh, describing what's about to happen, uh, where you are just trying to like shoot him down and you succeed. Uh, there's no like killing shot or anything. Uh, but as he fall, uh, I've rolled falling damage, uh, d6, and he's going to take <laughs> four damage, uh, which is sadly how many hit points he was on. Uh, so <laughs> as he lands, he is going to break his neck. Inside the parish, uh, but yeah, and also playing video it. games does not qualify you to talk about politics. <laughs> does uh, does his death release Rasputin from his uh, his par paralysis? No, but uh, I mean, either you guys wait for a minute, or well, oh yeah, no, because you have a guy bleeding out and you can cast hitting spells. No, yeah, I mean, you'd have to roll uh nine more uh rolls uh, <laughs> can anyone stabilize byron um on the attempt with um, i assistance. have two actions actually and i didn't get a chance to take my second one so yeah i can go stabilize byron hmm. oh we are out of uh, combat for something uh, you hear um, byron mum mummering under his breath like christina hendrix <laughs> <laughs> um so yeah uh yeah, we'll, we'll uh, try this. Um, so first of all, you guys can uh, roll uh, medicine checks. Try to stabilize them. Try to like st stymie the bleeding. 
Um, so 12 from me. I just rolled a straight roll, no advantage. Yeah, um, that's 12 medicine for you. And um, uh, Dorothy, you're helping him. Okay. Medicine. Yeah, yeah and I'll, I'll roll medicine. Hang on. Yeah. Uh, 14. 14. Unfortunately, uh, that doesn't help Byron. Um, and so, yeah, Byron and Rasputin. Uh, Byron, you can keep rolling death saving throws. And Rasputin, a roll for breaking out the paralysis. Sadly, Byron, I think you're first, buddy. Oh, snap. There it is. Natural 20, baby. Oh, nice. That counts as two successes. Oh, yeah. And I sit forwards and say, fools, I don't want medicine. I, want, I need wine. <laughs> <laughs> oh, excellent. And, yeah. uh, and if um, no one's going to hand me a bottle of wine, I'm waiting. No, I'm not waiting long. I'm going to stand up and look around the room for a bottle of wine. Uh, Tesla's just stunned for a moment. He goes, uh, Mark, Coleman, help him find some wine. Beautiful. Uh, but, uh, Byron, you can roll uh, to find wine as, uh, at advantage because you have zombie helps. Uh, Rasputin, you... <laughs> zombie Somalia. <laughs> uh, so I, I, I hit the con save uh, 16. And you are, you're fine. You're no longer paralyzed. So I think uh, Byron knowing that everybody else is dead would at least try and I don't even know if it would work at this point uh, use spare the dying on uh, our uh, strangely masked friend okay uh, that's um, I mean sadly he's not dying he is dead he is dead okay um, everyone is dead by the way since he technically since Daru shot him and he died. Do I get a grit point back for that as a significant opponent? Yes. Yeah, that's uh, no problem at all. Um, and Toby, you're going to love and hate this. Nope. How many corpses are yes. there in the room? There are four. <laughs> four Perfect. corpses. I'm going to cast uh, Animate Dead at fourth level. I I I'm going to and... motion towards Christina Hendricks and be like, Necrophilia, <laughs> Necro. <laughs> Yeah. Um, Byron's got a girlfriend <laughs> and two Somalias. This is a great event. <laughs> I'm reasserting control over the two that are here for the next 24 hours. <laughs> and I'm reanimating the four bodies that are in the room. All four of them. Wait, it would be four bodies? It would be three. Isn't one just boots? Oh, yeah. I suppose, uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You so incinerated one. Only three. Uh. Oh, that's literally the one who... My Frankenstein army grows. <laughs> <laughs> this is not uh, the direction I expected uh, <laughs> uh, Tassa to be... Uh, Nicola, would you uh, make the two with the masks uh, remove their masks? I would uh, like to please. see if, if they take, have take off your masks. we're looking for. And I'll get them okay. to take off their masks. Beautiful. Um, I don't have a tokens cloud at this precise moment. Uh, I'll try to arrange that for the future. Uh, 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 are my max hit points still 17? Yes. Okay. Uh, I think until a long rest. Maybe. Uh, uh, if he said permanent, it sounds like we might need something like a, a lesser restoration. Uh, Darudi, I'm going to need nah, you to carry a lot of bottles of wine with your big strength. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I, just think of them as like Popeye and spinach. Just, just always be carrying a bottle of wine. And next time, I don't see any pussy medicine checks from you. Just shove a <laughs> bottle of claret down my gullet. I'll be, I'll be back and ready to fight again. Are we clear on that? You are a very strange little man. <laughs> I've been called worse. Uh, I'll, I'll take it as a compliment. Yeah. So, so, uh, having reanimated the uh, corpses of your enemies. Uh, did you roll investigation for finding things? Wine? Uh, yeah, I rolled uh, 20, dirty 20. Okay. For looking around I think the, the question is now uh, how, these are the only people we knew who knew where our friend was or where it was going to be. How do we, how do we oh, find Oh, them? fuck that mission. I, I'm done with this bullshit. <laughs> like, we have tried Sorry. everything. You know what? Like, I just give up. Let's just go back. I, I told you this. I told you this, we cannot escape the timeline. Like, it is our destiny to go to the Bastille 
and join history rather than try and swim against the current of time. Man cannot do it. Are you with me? Byron, roll uh, perception. Unfortunately, that's only a 10. Okay. Is it perception or is he investigating? No, no, no. It's just I uh, want to okay. perception. Um, um, who's with him? Frankly, this sounds like a lot of work, but I, it might be the best place that we can find this person. I, I, I don't know where and when we are quite as well as some of you. Um, Darudi is going to... Um, uh, but Darudi is going to say, hold on for just a moment, uh, comrades, and he's going to pat down the... Can the zombies, can they answer, like, questions and stuff? Can they do th things, um, or are they just... Really. That's a, that's a third level spell. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm, I'm basically going to pat down the, the remaining zombies and see if there's anything in their pockets, any items or, or weapons that we can use. Uh, and I'm specifically going to be looking for um, anything that might give us a clue as to who we're uh, uh, seeking. I'll pat down Christina well, Hendricks. Okay. Uh, roll a um, uh, investigation check. I'll be instructing the animated zombies to assist as best they can. Mm-hmm. Uh, zombie Sog doing the help action. Yeah. 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 So you roll investigation with advantage. Okay. My investigation is probably not good, so someone else should do this after I do it. But um... I mean, Tesla should probably help, but he is helping with zombies. With <laughs> zombies. Uh, I, I got an 11. Okay, first roll is a 16. Mm hmm. And second roll. Not a 16. <laughs> so 16. You find a greatsword, if you're interested in having it. You'll find a plus one dagger on the body of um, uh, Christoph. Um, the pile of ash. Sadly, yields ash, <laughs> and um, you also gain a cool uh, gas mask. Um, I'll take. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll take the gas mask. Hmm. Uh, you realize that it's a, a strangely archaic design. It's like someone's seen a picture of a gas mask and then uh, made it using like 17th century uh, equipment mm -hmm. or a material. But yeah, it's a little bit steampunky. Uh. Um, Tesla, uh, should we search the room for maybe some paperwork? It seemed to benefit us last time. Yes. Anything let's, let's that might that. give us clues? Uh, uh, Coleman, uh, if you wouldn't mind lending a hand. Before you do that, uh, highest uh, passive perception is for Sputin, yeah? Uh, passive perception is 14. Yeah. There's no one else uh, higher passive? I match it. No? Cool, cool. Uh, so, yeah, Rasputin, you're the first person to hear. Um, the uh, footsteps appearing by the door. Um, I'm uh, clambering. Oh, not clambering, that's the wrong word. A kicking of the door, gentle kicking of the door, like someone opening the door with, uh, with a foot. And then you hear, Right, I'm back with all my things. Also, I uh, bumped into an uh, acquaintance, man. Um, his face obscured as he's carrying a large potted plant. Um, and he also has a um, number of bags uh, that he's struggling with under his arm. Um, there's a brief moment of silence Does as, he... we see, as we see a man poke out his head from behind the potted plant, take in the scene, drop everything, including potted plant, which shatters, and he says, oh shit! And then he turns his he he heels yeah. and runs. Before, okay, but um, run does he? Fucker. Yeah, does he seem to fit the description of the person that we're looking for? Yes, uh, behind uh, from the quick look that you saw, there's a um, uh, man in his thirties with a very unfashionable goatee. It's uh, Benedict Bloody Rose, finally. <laughs> yes. Um, All right. Um, I was trying to find a good li a likeness of him, and I couldn't. So maybe I should learn how to draw. <laughs> So, um, um, do we roll running, initiative? To... Tell him to oh, hold, please. He's going to roll a 27. So, um, Rose has um, just scuffed. Uh, you guys can 
or man, you're presumed to be Rose. Um, you guys could follow him. Uh, mm -hmm. Rasputin just tried to cast suggestion, uh, yep. but he His save was a twenty-seven. Mm. Yep. And can, can I Tesla's can I shoot him based on Byron, yeah. or can I shoot him or intimidate him? Yeah, you can we... like shoot him, uh, but yeah, he's disappearing out the door. Okay, you can uh, shoot him as he's doing so. I am going to. Um... He's already intimidated. That's why he's running. Oh, that's that's why he's running. Okay, I'm going to use winging shot. Uh, I'm not going to try to hurt him like badly, but I'm going to try to shoot him so he can't he can't run. Um, okay. All right, so that's going to be from my pistol. Um, so equipment actions. Here we go. Um, the, the joy of being dead for so long is I've still got plenty of key points. <laughs> mm. You are hasted now as well, which means I can run double. Uh, uh, that is a double. twenty-one. I'll, I'll message it to you. Twenty-one. Uh, will unfortunately miss. Ah. Uh, uh, okay, I'm doing it well. Uh, oof. I guess that means I'm out of my grit points. Um, uh, so Byron is chase is giving chase. Okay, so Byron's going to be chasing after the man, um, and the rest of you to hang around the apartment. I mean, I intend to follow, but far slower than Byron. <laughs> yeah, I I'm going to run after him as well. Beautiful. Uh, Byron being quickest, uh, you see the man um, running. Uh, into thin air and then reappearing again uh, at the bottom of the stairs. Um, so he's like cleared the entire three floors in roughly six seconds. And then he's out of the door down below you. Uh, being a hasty little bastard, you will not have huge problems catching up with him. Uh, but... Yeah, so I'm going to jump down the stairs, cast slow fall as a reaction, hmm. use my haste to move. Uh... Tesla, I believe it's seven, double my movement, right? Yep. 75 foot. Uh, and, and if that's not enough to catch him, use a key point to, to do another 35. So I can do 110 feet per turn. That is impressive. Damn. Um, Plus I just fell three stores, which should happen three floors, which should happen instantaneously. Yeah, yeah, I'm faster too. I don't have hit points, but I do have skills. <laughs> God damn. Glass cannon. <laughs> hmm. That's very impressive. All right. Um, yeah, you catch up with him. Uh, you are right next to him. Uh, he lashes out at you. Uh, could I have you roll a constitution saving throw at one place? With pleasure. My dump stat. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Is this a good time uh, to say that Tesla would have been uh, coming down the is, stairs with the zombies as well? Is this a spell and magical effect? Uh, this would be an ability. Okay, so... Um, oh wait, no, 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 sorry, what am I saying? This is a weapon attack. Okay, so, so I, I forgot this ability during the last fight, which would have come in handy. Uh, but but uh, yes, no, that's a natural one. Uh, minus <laughs> one for a zero. Alright, you hear a... Does, does that succeed? You hear a... Uh, <laughs> click, 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 um, as uh, he tases you. Oh, gosh. Shouldn't he have to roll a successful attack on him to tase him? No, nope. uh, because he's running. And uh, Byron's just been tasered. Um, I, I'd rest you following. Damn. Yeah, as fast as... As fast as... Uh, as fast as Rasputin can go, double dash is, you know, it's only 60 feet around. Yeah. Um, I have done... got the uh, zombies to just jump down the stairway so they fall through the middle. I just yeah. told them to block the door from to, to catch him. To catch him. Um, for the sake of retconning things, by the way, uh, from last mm -hmm. session, I said that you guys ended up somewhere roughly where you all started from, uh, and I thought I was stupid. So I've moved you into the center of town. You're now here. Oh, good. Uh, okay. Right. Uh, anyways, you will all catch up uh, with uh, Byron uh, as you see uh, Rose uh, running, panting, um, and he will just smack into a um, uh, column of soldiers marching up the road. Uh, you will be able to catch up so that you're about 60 feet away um, as uh, the column of soldiers led by what appears to be two civilians, uh, ugly looking bastards. 
uh, or sinister looking bastard, sinister looking ugly bastards um, <laughs> grinning uh, at uh, Rose, who, having looked behind him, is just smacks into larger one of them, falls back uh, on his back. And um, as you guys come closer, you hear, oh, serendipity, Master Rose, we've been looking for you. Um, and they haul him uh, to his feet and push him towards the soldiers. All right, take this one away. And what are you two looking at? Oh, sorry, what, what, what are you looking at? Uh, uh, do we recognize any of these as Le Pen's men, the landlord from before? Nope. Okay. Um, I think uh, if, you know, he's not totally gone from my side by the time that Rasputin arrives, uh, he, Rasputin has been accused of being part of some ministry uh, repeatedly and uh, will ask these guards, whoever they are, um, uh, oh, th thank heavens that you've grabbed him. Are, uh, are you also a part of the ministry? They uh, glance at each other and go, ministry? Pray tell. Seize these men as well. Um, and you will roll mischief as the soldiers uh, yeah, how many uh, start soldiers? moving towards him. How many you can see there's a column about 20 of them. Oh, no worries. I, like, slightly more than hit points I have. It's fine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, initiative. Um, okay. Let's see if I do better than the natural one my, the last time. Uh, eight. Son of a eight. Uh, 17. 22. Sorry. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Eight from me. And I've got quite a low dexterity bonus, so I imagine I'd go after whoever got the other eight. Okay. Uh, uh, Drifty? Uh, Seventeen. Seventeen, beautiful. <laughs> uh, so that would be Rasputin at the top of the round. Right. Um, so uh, the two uh, two men they're dressed anachro anachronistically, um, but they're, fair, they're smartly dressed. Um, the one of the soldiers, uh, uh, sir, what, what do you do this one? And they'll. I said, take, take him to a, what's the what's the large uh, prison called? The Bastille. Yes, why not? Take him there. Uh, and uh, at least you now have a face to your quarry. You know where he is, and you perhaps should have just listened to Byron all along and just gone to the Bastille and waited for him there. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, friends, in your defence, uh, nine times out of ten I speak nonsense. There's no hard feelings for the, for the one gem amongst the, <laughs> the swine, shall I say. And so hopefully we shall uh, bring this uh, saga to a conclusion next time. On, on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> on History Dragon Ball, Ball Z. Z. <laughs> <laughs> on History Ball Z. History Balls. <laughs> epic, rap, epic rap battles of Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah, Man, you, I'll everyone. tell you. I feel like um, I, I'm disappointed that we did not keep Christina Hendricks alive, um, oh, uh, or 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 Sword Lady, um, <laughs> but for all the wrong reasons. Yeah. <laughs> I feel um, relieved that was coming to a bad place quickly. I um, I, I was actually pleasantly surprised that you guys um, succeeded quite that quickly in the fight. Um, I expected yeah. to be a lot more. Even, but uh, yeah, and even I, I like according to stats, they even had a chance of winning. But yeah, it was it was going to turn at the start. There, they had Byron dead to rights. Yeah, I think we lucked out with some good rolls and some good strategy there. Yeah, me me bringing yeah. Tessa back from the brink, like yeah. just about mm. safe. I was I was cheeky with that storm sphere. I I was being very uh, I was being very tactical about how he would consider her as his friend. But not necessarily Oscar, yeah. and locking Dirty down was like a good little way. It, I was I was working my angles there. I was like, how can mm. I keep that guy locked in and do minimal damage, but still do damage that will set me up for later. 
Yeah, I blocked out yeah. really well. Yeah. So, uh, it so was I've... lucky that when I when I fired wildly, I, I just obliterated <laughs> one of the. Uh, I say I wasn't quite sure if I should count um, your um, uh, machine gun as a magical weapon or not mm -hmm. in the end because it is rare and it's like your rare choice. I thought that no, no, having a magical weapon, it, it's more fair. Uh, so I count as magical damage. I regretted that rapidly when I saw that, like in the first time, you just took off two thirds of her HP. I'm like, <laughs> oh, that was a mistake. All right. <laughs> so, so if that had not been considered a magical item, she would have been. Uh, she would have. You, you, you're it. taking off like a third of her hit points rather than two thirds, but yeah. I was amazed she could take that much punishment. What what class no, was she? Was right, she a fighter? So, no, so basically, uh, in that fight, we for a uh, or. Jesse, can you guess? Uh, Vampire. Succubus. Vampire. Oh, yes, so one succubus. Yeah. <sighs> uh, he, obviously, uh, you know, succubus kiss, whatever. Yeah. Uh, she she never even had a mesmer. chance to heal. Um, her, her, she was going to like go ethereal, come back, uh, heal uh, by, you know, doing the whole um, mwah. I mean, yeah, <laughs> uh, one brave, uh, one knight, and a spectator. Amazing. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, because most spectators are, you don't see them often, they're kind of cute. What the yeah. hell is a spectator? I don't know. It's I'm like a mini know. beholder. Yeah. yeah. Ah. Baby beholder. Uh, can someone please remind Byron next time that he has advantage on saving throws against spells and magical effects? Because I forgot. <laughs> oh. That would have been quite that's handy. The, uh, of all my weaknesses, Jesus. that's the uh Oh, actually, no, now I'm a satyr, right? Oh, yeah, <laughs> so that'd be gone. Yeah. Mm. I kept thinking to myself, like I've got something in in uh, that that I could just end a charmed effect on somebody, but I don't I don't think that I do. I think that was just something I was staring at while building other characters. I remember that being a monk feature at like level eight or nine or something. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we got a level eight monk, but uh... I think he's multi class. No, here's, yeah, the, four, here's four. the problem. Like I, I know five, five three. three. Yeah, five three. I, I really did this time just go for the build that felt the most honest. And that's, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was when good, I though. see you guys doing 70 damage, I'm like, uh, no, I can flirt with the big bad boss. <laughs> yeah. By the way, um, our zombies, um, Dirty would have checked for this, but they didn't have any, uh, like, uh, they didn't have any armor or anything on them, did they? No, not. I mean, uh, the Wraith would have had a leather armor, and uh, so would Oscar. Um, whereas the two women were basically uh, wearing very little. <laughs> oh, okay, you. so that that explains it. So, um, yeah, the, and Drudy already has leather armor. So, okay. Uh, whereas, I mean, what, what do you roll for investigation? Sixteen, yeah. Uh, yeah, it was sixteen. I was basically. I'm just looking. Mm -hmm. Do it. Uh, you found, uh, I would say you found some uh, studded leather armor. Uh, it's like a fancy tactical gear uh, of the Wraith. Sweet. Uh, well, Darudi's going to wear that then, I think. You can have some um, studded leather armor. Yes. I, I'm going to stop recording. This was enough bonus content for the uh, yeah. D&D &D nerds. <laughs> but so, yes, I just see Jesse's clock that because I have advantage against spells, I can be in the middle of the uh, the storm. And, and I might yep. survive it. Yeah. It's a high risk, high reward thing, and I think I, I think you're right. That does play into Byron's sort of oh yes legend. I'll just go to one. Oh no, I can take it like Scrappy Doo. I've got the hit points. I can. Take That's a bear. It. It'll it'll work out. Ah, <laughs> oh, gents, that was great fun. Thank you. Ah, oh, pleasure.